This is the sled start install for the nitro. The module itself is mounted on top of the radiator bracket, the plastic bracket, and zip tied to it. The power leads come down and go to the battery. You have your key switch connector, which I have pulled out a little bit here to show you. And that loom comes down into the brake connector boot. And the brake connector itself runs from the module along the top here. The connector for the injector is run from the module and run underneath above the steering post with the other split loom from the factory to the other side of the sled. And that comes into the injector, which you're going to use on the uh, clutch side, the far clutch side injector. And then that split loom continues on. And there's the bypass switch running along the factory routing over to the clutch cover pin switch. And with this switch out, the sled will not start. And that's pretty much it. You have a uh, antenna that's mounted. I'll show you that in a second. You have the ground for the pin switch and the, and the toggle switch. They share the same ground. And the antenna I mounted right on the top of the same bracket, the plastic bracket that's over the radiator. Very simple install on the nitro. You can run all your split loom pretty much right along with the factory stuff. And uh, it's a pretty clean install for the nitro. If you have any questions, you can contact us at contact underscore us at sledstart.com.